the always amusing Seth Meyers, and now I'm going to show him how to make a raspberry rhubarb grunt. A grunt? A grunt. And I don't know why it's called a grunt, but it's also called a slump. Though you have to be really delicious to call yourself a slump or a grunt. I know, I know. But, uh, you know, it's all in that family of cobblers and, gotcha. and, uh, and pan dowdies and um, there's sure, a whole sure, lot of other sense. names. Yeah, all those funny <laughs> names. All those old English names. So first we're going to prepare the rhubarb and raspberry. So we're going to cook these gorgeous raspberries. Want one? Yeah, thank you. Those are really pretty. And uh, so there's four cups of raspberries. This costs about, at this time of year, it costs, how much are these? Like $7 a little box? Yes, there so are, this I think is twenty-eight dollars right of raspberries, which we're now going to mush up. Can that's you, how I we mean, roll. That's it, and that's called a grunt, for God's sake. <laughs> and one pound of rhubarb. How much is the rhubarb a pound these days? The rhubarb is nine ninety-nine today. Oh, so that's already we're up twenty. To, yeah. Oh my God, we're up to thirty-eight dollars. Thirty-seven ninety-nine. Okay. Yeah. And a pinch of salt. That's great. This I'm going to break my record for rhubarb consumed in a day yep. today. Just so you you're going to be you're going to have eaten like twenty dollars worth of rhubarb. Yeah. Oh, and don't think I won't Three tell everybody. Three quarters of a cup of sugar. <laughs> now I don't usually make fun of things, but this is you know April Fool's Day, and you can do anything on April Fool's Day. A pinch of cinnamon. Great. Two <laughs> tablespoons of freshly squeezed lemon juice. Don't forget, it has to be fresh, Seth. Okay, gotcha. And two <laughs> tablespoons of water. Fresh yeah, water? It has to be fresh water, okay. too. Okay. Always fresh water, okay, no matter good. what. <laughs> Even though it's a grunt, we don't want to get that from the from the puddle down on the street. <laughs> right. It was raining this I, morning, you know. I hardly ever use street water anymore. Okay, like, good. Okay. I, don't, I don't want you to. So here, here is our... Thirty-eight. That's great. <laughs> Lots of sugar and everything mixture, which we're now going to just heat up. Oh, you can mix the top. What am I doing? You can mix the top. Okay, great. Now the top. We're just going to simmer this a little bit, get it hot. I hope you, okay. Great. Okay, you mix. Okay. I'll, I'll put the stuff in three quarters and of I'm a mixing cup with of this? flour. Yeah. Right. A pinch of salt. Lots of people, lots of guests come on here and they think that this is the salt measured out, but you have to read. It says a pinch very a clearly. Pinch. Clearly written. Pinch. Great. Three quarters of a teaspoon of baking powder. Great. Oops, that doesn't want to come off. There we go. It's really okay. coming together. Why, Martha, why, look at this. Why, why, would, why would you have baking powder? Why would you? Yeah. Because then you're officially baking. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> a quarter of a teaspoon of ground ginger. Two tablespoons of sugar. Great. So really mix it. We want to make yeah, sure you yeah, get the no, edges. Of course. Or, Great. Okay. And we have now a third of a cup of whole milk. Okay. And two tablespoons of butter, which we're going to melt it, which we're going excuse me, which we are going to mix together. Okay. And this makes kind of the these are like the little biscuit toppings or the cobbler topping. Great. Yes. What was the other thing you said? Grunt. The grunt slump. topping and the slump slump topping. Great. And the slurry. Oh, slurry. These are all really <laughs> delicious words. And the pandowdy. Oh, pandowdy. That's pandowdy is really All right, this got a lot harder. I like put that. the egg in there. Okay. Now keep stirring. I am, stirring. but look, it's just, it's okay, becoming keep, a ball. It's, that's, you want that. You oh, want, you do? Yeah, you want all dry ingredients to disappear. Okay. Well, okay. Then. So now the rhubarb and raspberry is I'm warm. I'm getting sauce over here. It's warm. Well, that, well, this has to cook a little bit, and we have one already done here. And here, bring it over here. Okay, I'm bringing it. Now, you're going to have to get that out of that. Now, okay. you, you figure that one out. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right, wait. Uh, you have to get it out of... I'm, I'm trying... Wait, uh, hold I, on. Can I, I use other stuff? Uh, yes, anything right. you want. You can use your fingers. Oh, fingers. Yes. Trust me. Don't, don't you don't want me to use my fingers. Don't, right, don't, don't ruin the whisk. Well, all right. <laughs> well, you, you make dresses out of whisks here. I know. <laughs> This is, I've got, I'm going to guess, you tell me if I'm wrong, you would have done this a different way than I'm doing right now. I would have not used a whisk, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I would have used the whisk just for the stirring. Hey, we have video of this. I, you handed me this whisk. <laughs> only to sift. Oh, oh we only have one minute left. Oh, my God. Oh, good. Here, go. Well, go. Move now, on. Now go like this. Okay. You know, if we have a minute See? left, I don't know if I harp oh, on the fact minute. I didn't get it all out. No. Okay, so now take your little spoons and you're going to make canel.
like canel de brochette. You have those, right? When you sure, go, of course, canel de brochette, absolutely. When you when you eat at uh, at Grumley, yeah, you know, yeah, you yeah. go there for lunch, sure, right? Of course, every day. Okay, so put little canel right on top okay. of the warm raspberry. Oh wow, I Rhubarb see how this you mix. do this. See? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, see, it's very nice, shapely. Oh, yours is better than mine. Yeah, oh, well, you know, it's not a contest, but it's very <laughs> special. <laughs> we can turn it into a contest if you'd like. Yeah, no, this is you're playing like this is a pool hustle. You're gonna now we're gonna put money on it. See how nice that is? You make yeah. nice shapely canal. All right, yep. There's no other way okay. to make a canal. Nope. Great. Oh, yours are fat. They're really... Oh, use well. it all. Use okay. it all. And it's here. 38 bucks. Use we that. can't waste anything here. Nothing. Don't waste a thing. And then we're going to mix a quarter of a teaspoon of cinnamon with two tablespoons more sugar. Great. And we're going to put that on top of the little biscuit mix. See what I'm doing? This is, this is my process. Oh, it's fab. Yeah. Yep. It didn't work out that well. well <laughs> but you can get a job at Grunwee anytime when you when you yeah, yeah, yeah. when you lose your lose the words, you go over there and Absolutely. make some make some lose the words, replace slump. it with the canal. Make this some is looking good. Here. Look how pretty, see? Yeah. So you sprinkle this all over. Great. And you cover it, bring it up to a, a higher heat. Look, and this is what it looks degrees? like. Look. Ooh. That's what it looks like when it's cooked. That is not bad at all. And so you want to taste this? I absolutely do. This 45 counting gas from the stove and uh, your time. Your right. time must be very valuable. You must, seven fifty an hour. Oh, seven hundred and fifty dollars an no, hour. No, seven point five zero. Yeah. Really? Minimum After way. the writer, writers strike and everything, that's all you get. And we got up to seven fifty. Oh that's before my god! Oh my goodness! So, uh, like commissions, like to the to the agents to and my stuff. My agents, yeah. Uh oh, that's bad. My agent gets ten percent of this dessert. Okay. <laughs> but here, let me just. Let me just wipe off this little, I don't like to Yeah, I, I would not have eaten it if you hadn't wiped new, that new, off. New, new, new. Tell me what you think of the slump. All right. The grunt. Mm. Really good? Yeah. <laughs> That's why you grunt when so you eat be it. be sure to catch Seth this weekend on Saturday Night Live. You never know what he's going to tell you. Thank you very Thank much. You. <laughs>